At the end of the day, this town treated me good. I want to do a good job. I want to provide a good service for them. Going on 40 years. <laughs> Actually, yeah, going on 40 years now in Novi. My mom worked for City of Novi for over 20 years. I came here my whole youth, you know, growing up within the Civic Center. So I've been with the city now going on nine years. This will be my ninth year. Uh, started off as a light equipment operator. Uh, it was great. I really uh, enjoyed my time there, but this position opened up and uh, kind of a new adventure that really turned out to be a blessing. I fabricate, I design install signs within local roads, major roads. You know, you'll have either residents or coworkers will be out on the road and they'll see a damaged sign. And they put in a work order and, and from there on, I, I go out there, I inspect, I, you know, assess the situation. And if it's something that need, requires a whole new setup, uh, I go out and back to the computer, back to shop, design, uh, then fabricate, and then I go back out and install whatever it may be. There's a maintenance aspect to it to where you there's a shelf life on everything right so you'll end up going back and uh and replacing signs so often it's kind of a neat neat deal neat process the guys that i i get to work with on a daily basis here we always have functions down here we'll have barbecues it's really cool that, that you develop a great bond with within coworkers where it's almost makes it that much of a better experience coming to work, right? We all have one goal at the end of the day, right? Which is to, you know, provide a good service for our community. It is a juggling situation with, you know, like the long nights on overtime. There's always gonna be a bump in the road. It's just how you can overcome and persevere. So one of my coolest experiences here working at uh, City of Novi was a few years back, a whole bunch of people came and paid homage to uh, one of my schoolmates and close uh, family friends, Andrew Becker. He was actually uh, involved in a, a training accident in the Air Force that, that unfortunately took his life. And um, he was just, he was such a charismatic person and great guy to be around and, and, and for, for City of Novi to go above and beyond and, and dedicate a memorial to him and, and show what kind of character he was. That's just another, another great reason why, you know, Novi is that, you know, tight niche community that it is. Novi is home to me. You know, it's it's kind of it's always been home for me. It's been it's been a blessing living in this town, and you know, and, and now I get to work for it too, and it, which is it's even cooler. I have family that lives in this town. I have friends that lives in the town. I have friends now family that lives in this town. At the end of the day, this town treated me good. I'd like to have them to have the same opportunity. <laughs>